No, but slowly I can see your plan unfolding open in front of me. My walk is far from over, strolling, holding on to pieces. The reasons I feel them chosen, rendered incomplete. A trophy far from worthy. Now I know we're steady praying at the seams of these dreams to be controlled with the Holy Spirit reigning over, pleading peace. But with the thoughts of this poet, my soul is off, and I know it. The daily routine of incompetence, attempt to portray your silent providence. Only you know that I'm the image of wickedness, lacking with access to everything. My lack is deliberate, lack wisdom and innocence, lack meekness, my weakness. Keep this selfish and bivalent Self-righteous diction of fulfillment To serve myself and my influence Using your name's sake To make your name free The sickness is crippled My mission sipping on the gin Need deep in a battle I'm wishing God bless the ignorant Who saw my life a lack of delivered it Fall on my knees I worship you I can feel the morning dew Sun shining through There was nothing I can't do If I is a place with you Make haste and move The sea can make mountains move if it's grounded, you see the flower bloom. There is nothing we can't do. If we all look like you, let me write your truth. Yeah. One, two, three, fast. That's good. Again. Faster. Beautiful. Again. Not so quick. Again. Again. Clinch comes in, you can wide wave with your arms. Don't let him clinch, push him back. Good. 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 Yep, keep it, 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 and time. Good job, Justin. You're really nice. You jumped your side by side. Yeah, yeah. that didn't work out too well. So. All right. Yeah, it's easier, cheaper to fix, easier to fix. <laughs> Good. Let's go face down. We're going to stretch your back out. Yep. You okay with a couple needles in this area? Yeah. Don't feel paralyzed me or good.
Bam. That'll help. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, just go home. My mom's gonna make us some lunch. Uh, I usually lift today, but I think I'm just gonna run on the treadmill and then sit in the sauna. It's kind of Trevor told me it's a down week, so I'm gonna try my hardest to rest. But I definitely need to work, so I don't feel like a I feel like I'm losing my capacity. But we'll see. Week four, we got Tuesday sparring. Uh, coach, me, coach has me on a down week, so we're just doing three rounds today. I kind of get to, uh, the goal is to uh, keep their feet moving as always. Can we start round four? Yeah. Cool. Control their feet. Um, and have fun, and that's not usually on the docket, so that I'm gonna do. But just three rounds, so nothing crazy. Um, been training hard for eight weeks. A little bit of a down week this week, so we can push it really hard the next two weeks, and then cut weight the last week. So like he's down weight right now, so I'm doubling like all the fat in his smoothies um, to like add extra calories. Um, but it, it pretty much stays the same. When he's not in the fight, like sometimes we'll do a little bit more fun things. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's pretty much the same, very clean. Damn, that was a good rack. That was a good rack. <laughs> Did he just let me win? Obviously. Let's <sighs> think about the snow. Colorado sun. To be expected. Hopefully we get a lot more. Oh god. Jesus. Damn. Oh my god, that just is hard to put. You probably pull it back way easier to me. God damn. Nice Hi, Sick. I almost put a hole in gloves. Hey, what do you mean I hit the target? It was good. <laughs> oh, you shot the same spot I did. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was hitting for. Oh, oh yeah, that's nice. That was in your spot. Stupid. Mongolian. That's cool. You know, this, like where they, this is how they got their beef for their Mongolian beef. <laughs> beef is what's for dinner. I like it. I really do like it. It's cool. It's, just, it's really like a traditional stick, bro. Come on, get it. Come on. So I heard of Justin Gaethje through my gym, uh, Grudge Training Center, and this is back in 2009. It might have been like two, uh, late 2008, uh, but I heard a lot of the guys talking about they seen him fight at one of the Ring of Fires, and, uh, and the wrestling coach was also talking about him. So I heard his name, and it was funny because I thought he was for some reason I thought he was Japanese. You know, someone gives you a name you kind of picture what you think they'd look like i pictured him being japanese for some reason i was traveling to tokyo a lot and for some reason the name gaichi sounds you know for some reason i've sounded japanese it's kind of crazy to me now i think that but uh 
I pictured him being a Japanese guy, and then I was at a ring of fire, and I remember someone saying Gaethje was gonna fight next. So I was sitting back in the locker room, and he wasn't in our locker room, so I didn't know who he was. Uh, so I went out and watched, and man, his style was so unique, and he totally was not what I thought he would look like. Uh, but his style was one of the most unique styles I've ever seen. Like, he had no striking, he would like, drop, look at the ground when he bobbed and weaved and throw just wild hooks, but it was his wrestling that stood out to me. And he would put, pick people up and slam them like I've never seen before. And I've seen Rampage do his slams, things like that. But his scrambles, his roll throughs, when people would try to take him down, it was just spectacular. It was almost like watching a circus act. Uh -huh. It was so cool. And uh, I remember hearing that his name highlight from Sven Bean, who had named him. He was also another guy who had talked about him. So I went back and I talked to him in the locker room. He was sitting there by himself. And I just went, went up and introduced myself and said, hey man, I was uh, just watched you fight, heard a lot about you, and I'm a, I'm a fan of you. Like that fight was freaking awesome. And told him I invited him to the gym and he ended up coming down, coming down and, start, and started the train at uh, Gross Training Center a few months later. But he was in college uh, and never sparred, never worked out in an MMA gym and already had four amateur fights. So I thought that was super unique. Oh, we're on a Wednesday. I just had to work out with Trevor. Now I'm going to go home, eat some food. And then go do my strength conditioning at Landau. And then we got our jiu-jitsu coach, George, from Florida. He's in town. Came in just in time for the snow and the cold. And we got a grappling session tonight at 6. Oh, I got a burger, a bison burger. Here's some delicious. Oh, what the fuck this is. Some grilled onions. Some homemade sauce, which I have no idea what it is. Carrots, sweet potatoes, sweet potato fries. And that's a Guy's face, turn it, boom, leave it one. Yeah. Real shoulder. Mm -hmm. Fresh the leg, fresh the leg. Mm -hmm. 
Tough, just drill session. You know, it was all about getting the reps in today. We didn't do any live. Um, you know, we, we did a lot of speed drilling. You know, stuff that gets the heart rate real high, and uh, you know, trying to replicate, replicate and emphasize finishing when they're tired, right? And still being able to execute and be crisp when you're tired. So that was the goal of today. Four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. You want some of this? Thank you so much. 